I'm back with no makeup and stained lips so let's get on with it okay so first I'm taking I would say my only stick foundation but we're not going to talk about that elf one so we're taking Lottie London's all about that base still got quite a lot of product in it I was deciding my life decisions if I should put concealer on before I'm just gonna put this on and just do concealer after there my lips are better now okay now it's done we're taking a cream concealer which is Primark's one I think today we're going to go for a natural dewy look so there is such thing as cream to powder but that's normally foundations I think and I don't have one of those so I'm taking my cream contour palette this was like the first ever like contour bronzer type product I ever used and then I found powder and haven't used this since as you see I'm a big lover of it oh god gonna work because the darker shade is literally like gone and the lightest one's like my colour so let's see oh god I hope it goes right I haven't cream contoured in like months I love this it is so buttery like it just melts in your finger when you do it and if you want like a natural gleam like this is not glittery it's got glitter in it but it's more of the shiny healthy natural highlights the face kind of highlight it's not glittery at all and it just blends out so well don't even need to use a brush for this. For brows, we're going to use a pomade because those are the only cream products you can have. I'm taking ColourPop's, what's it called? Banging Brunette. This is just turning out to be a ColourPop video. Okay guys, so next we're moving on to the eyes. I'm going to take the only cream eyeshadow I own. And it is so rubbish, so don't recommend to anyone. It is from Lush. This dries down, a good thing is it dries down really quickly, but it's so expensive. It's like, what, it costs like 10 quid? Maybe, I think it's just a colour. It's, it's sheer. It dries down, it's basically clear. But yeah, let's put this on. Could you put this on? Look how pigmented that is. But then you blend it out, and it's like gone. Like, where is it? And yeah, it's basically non-existent. And by the end of the day. It's gone, it's not even there, like you didn't put any eyeshadow on. So there's that, not a fan. I'm going to test that two gel eyeliner and see which one's better. One in the pen form from Benefit and the other one in a gel form from Colourpop in Swirp. So let's see how well this goes. I'm gonna do Benefit on this eye and Colourpop on that eye. Oh, I hate this pen so, so much. It does a 
doesn't help that I can't really see what I'm doing in the mirror but let's just leave it there and go on to Colourpop this is brand new so hopefully it goes on easy oh wow look how smooth it glides on Okay, the eyeliner is done. This went on so much easier, but it's easier to mess up with this one. Yeah, but I do not like Benefits Pen. It's just, it's just a nightmare. I'll be using it up and saying bye bye to it. So let's move on to mascara. I've got two. I want to try out to see which one's better. They're both from Mac. It's their samples of In Extreme Dimension 3D Backlash and Zoom Fast Backlash. I'm going to use zoom on this one and dimension on this one. It's a very thin, there's loads of small bristles coming out of this, so let's see. It's quite dry. Because of the brush, when you pull it out, I think like all the product comes out off it. Okay, zoom lashes just dried out, like, I must have had it a while because nothing's coming out. So instead, I'm just going to use my MAC full lashes extreme black. Last but not least, let's move on to the lips. So I'm going to take the famous MAC Ruby Roo. I remember I've been wanting this for ages and ages and when I bought it, I was in love, but I only use it, I haven't used it, I've used it like once maybe. Do you find that like you want something for ages and you buy it and you don't really use it? This might be the first time you guys have seen me apply a bullet lipstick. Because now liquids is out, I don't see the point in these. They come off. These are hard to apply because they can go everywhere. Whereas you have a bit more control for liquid. I love this, it's so creamy. You can tell I don't wear bullet lipsticks. And yeah guys, that's the final look. It's very natural. You could wear this in the daytime. Wear a different colour lip, I guess, if you want. The highlight and contour is just na so natural. The eyes are natural. I liked everything in this video. So yeah, that is it for me. Hope you guys like this only cream look. I think that like, cream works together. You don't always need liquids. It works just fine. You don't need powder. Got this nice dewy look. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Comment down your thoughts, feelings, and opinions down below. And until then, I'll see you guys next time.